Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today we're going to watch and react on the second episode of the TV show Barbarian on Netflix. Um, in the previous episode, um, the war began be between uh, Romans and Barbarians because um, Romans asked for a tribute for each um, villages and um, when he went to um, the main village where there is a wreck um, he asked the wreck to kiss the eagle the symbol of Romans apparently and uh, when um, I think it's Susnelda, Susnelda, I don't know how you pronounce this, this name, but basically the girl uh, is pushing her father off so he doesn't kiss the eagle and the Roman on the horse is mad, he takes her hair and um, her little brother defends her and is hit on the head and uh, we thought uh, he was dead but he, he wasn't dead because um, her sister, his sister basically asked, um, I think, a witch to save him, but he's now basically like a vegetable. <laughs> uh, I don't know how uh, you can pronounce this, but it, it, it's like he's still dead inside. And um, and so she was full, full filled with rage. And um, she went with her lover to the Roman camp and she stole the, the eagle and get it back to the camp, the, her, her camp. And the episode uh, ends with, um, we thought that it was the son of uh, the Roman general and apparently he's not, he's the rake son. So yeah, it handed like that. So I'm pretty excited to see what's gonna happen and how we came to be with the Romans. So yep, let's get to it. Mm. A wolf. Ah, uh, maybe they're gonna explain about the Roman. That's how you got, you know, the the teeth on the necklace. And that's how we recognize it because it was their friend, I think. What the hell? You, Ro your name. Romans. Are you Ari? This will be good to our sons. No. Wait a minute, he gave all of his sons. What the fuck? Even the baby. Maybe that was the price for peace, I don't know. It's... How can you do that? How can you give up? I am giving you as a pledge. Your children. For peace between our peoples. Yeah. You're giving me away? Father, please, don't send us away. Oh, Father, please, please. Sad. I know where the eagle is. What the fuck? Seriously? This man is. How can he. 
how can he be a traitor after what the Romans did to his son? Like, he's unbelievable, this man. I fucking swear. Mm -mm. Mm, that's probably his mother's. Now. <laughs> like those piss drinkers or something. <clears throat> but you didn't have a choice. Look what they've made of you, Ari. Give me the evil, and you go live your lives and I'll live mine. I always believed that one day you'd come back. You'd grow into such an asshole. Hmm. I mean, he, he grew up. He grew up with the Romans. What were you expecting? Like. My uncle! You're the one who chopped off its head! I carried out a sentence. Hmm. Oh yeah? Are you a god? I love the man who was at the camp. The Roman camp. He's gonna die? No way. Mm. Something. He's gonna kill him. Yeah, he had to. He had to do it. It's his friend still. Hmm. Now the time to. <laughs> Take care of your son. <laughs> You're just a coward. I wasn't given a choice. I made a new life possible for you. I made it possible myself. Yeah, you didn't do anything no, about except giving up your child. Mm -mm. Not one step further, Meryl. Mm, missed him on purpose. I didn't want to kill him. I think. He fell off? No. Possibly because it's, you know, of his wound. Come back here now! You Roman rat! Hurry! 
Den. Just gonna leave him here. What the fuck? It doesn't matter because the the general is is on his way for the village though. Because of this bastard. They won't find the eagle. So what? They're gonna kill that man for lying. That's all he deserves, honestly. Like he betrayed his own family. For what? Power? And the wife is aware. What the fuck? These parents are fucking idiots. I'm gonna make it to the game. In the camino of yesterday, you said this. They're innocent, they didn't do anything. Fuck, they killed the father. Oh my god. Fucking hell. He, he, stole the, he, he has the eagle back just to save them and he's gonna die. Oh my god, that's so fucking awful. This is stupid. It's too, he, he just threw the eagle in the water. What the fuck? It's so dumb. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna get it back. You did that for nothing. That was the eagle. Oh my god. I think there is crocodile in here. Oh no, a wolf. Yeah, you have bad memories with wolf. I'm just here to remind you that you're a bell boy and not a Roman. You have to run away, boy. It was her idea and he's Taking all the blame. Fuck her father. Look closely, Cherulski. What does it do? How Rome punishes hubris. Did Did you undo that? No. Please kill this man, I can't Shame bear to, to see him. Shame on you all! You, you're arguing in front of the dead! Shame on you! All of you! Go home! Go! You can't, you can't let them you can't leave them here. Eat him. Eat him, please. Please take them down. It's just... He's just a boy. 
Oh my god, Fulcrum, I'm so sorry. This is awful. <sighs> this is this idiot is finally back to the king. Sette tipi, uno sull'ultimo mi fu negando un est. Onus legionis nostra e restituendus. Opus est un mulchischi qui aquilam nostra marabuit. Niente mi fiesco i costi, figli miei. E per esse un profetto. No way, don't ask him to kill him. It's his friend, for God's sake. Well, that was a good episode. Um, I wasn't expecting this. Um, I knew um, father, her father was uh, a bastard but um i wasn't expecting him to be a traitor because of what happened to his son but like yeah this is this is awful <laughs> i can't believe this well i am um, i don't know what's gonna happen next but i i honestly don't want to watch the two friends fight and one of them dying. He basically got to the camp to save them. And he didn't save them at all. It's worse. <laughs> yeah. Well, tell me in the comments what you thought about this episode. Um, my opinion of this episode is that it was fucking good. Um, we we learn more about Harry, how he got Roman and, and stuff, and uh, we learned uh, that he was a, f a childhood friend of uh, Tnell's dad and um, Forquin, and. But they still, you know, hold this friendship. They still care about each other. Mm. But yeah, the, the Falkwin's family dying, it's just awful. He just wanted to do the right thing and do something for the one he loves, the girl he loves. And it's just is just the one to be blamed when it's not his idea at all. It's hers. I can't believe this. Wow. Anyway, thank you, thank you for watching with me. And tell me in the comments what you thought about this episode. Leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you very soon for another reaction. Until then, take care.